Okay, learn to expand expression like that. It's very important because this is the base for later on you're doing uh, factoring. Okay, so this is the expansion is the opposite of factoring. It's important that you have a good uh, foundation for this. So later on when you do factoring, you won't have any trouble. So the base of this one, it's really so simple actually. It's this one is having a party. It takes cementation to this person and then it takes to this person or there's more person people in the house or room you have to take it to everyone so here what we're going to do is 2a since there's a multiplication here it's literally times 4 okay this plus sign and then 2a takes the invitation to 3a and so on and so forth okay 2a times 4 that's 8a and from here it's 2 times a times 3 times a and so what you have is 6 times a times a. Okay, a times a, there's a quicker way we write it in mathematics. We call it a squared. When we put a hat on a, we're basically saying what? Let's just duplicate a twice by multiplication. By that idea, a times a times a is equal to a to the cube. Okay, if I have times a again, that'd be the a to the fourth, so on and so forth. Okay, that's just a shortcut to write it. So let's clean it up a little bit. 8a plus 6a squared. Okay, let's try another one. What if I have a 3c times 3 plus 2c? This one takes imitation over, imitation over. I have a 9c for the first one, plus 3c times c times 2 times c. So I have 9c plus 6c squared because I have two of them. Okay, hope this helps. Have a confident day.